Hello everyone, welcome to our Timeless Oracle reading. Our Oracle card for today belongs to Into the Lonely Woods Oracle by Lucy Cavendish and illustrated by Dan May. The card for today is entitled, There is One Who Watches Over You. One of the most beautiful gifts that we can receive when we are when we begin to join within is the awareness of the transcendent or the divine in our life sometimes we when we least expect it the divine reveals itself to us and one of the best description of that experience is that of psalm 139 wherein the one who experiences the presence of the divine, which I call the touches of God, the touches of the divine. When you experience the touch of the divine, you know that the divine is there. You know that that transcendent truly exists. But you cannot put into the word, into words, you cannot put into words the experience of that awareness you cannot put into words how to describe the presence of the divine the experience of the presence of the divine in that moment of your life that's why when we look at psalm 139 the the person who experiences that touch of the divine tries to describe it by saying you are before me you are behind me you are around me you you are just here <laughs> something like that uh, that's why also the description of Yahweh I am Yahweh meaning I am or God is or he is it's something like that you you just know that the divine exists the divine is there one one famous psychologist uh, would describe it as quantum moment um, I forgot the name of this psychologist but but he described it as a quantum moment and this quantum moment is that moment wherein you least expect it but it suddenly happens and uh, it is something that is memorable, something that you cannot forget. In fact, you remember the detail of that moment, of that experience. It is something that is enduring. And it is something that has a significant effect in your life. Something that will be part of your life. It is a moment of transition. And suddenly things will no longer be the same. But it's not only the presence of the divine that sometimes we encounter in our journeys within. We also become aware that there are some guides that accompany us. Just like this owl in the picture, uh, you become aware of your angels when your clear gifts open, you become aware that you are being guided, whether it be angels, your ancestors, uh, spirit animals, you realize that you don't have to go through life's challenges alone and it becomes more exciting and less burdensome because when you encounter new challenges you always have these guardier, guardians these watchers who whom we can always turn to we always we can always turn to them and say help us guide us where should we go something like that your journey now becomes more exciting and happier because sometimes even when you are alone you know that you are not alone so this is one of these wonderful gifts when you become aware that you are not alone and that you don't have to go through life's challenges alone the journey becomes easier more exciting you know that in your solitude you are much more in touch with everything around you with your inner self also and you discover new things 
as you go through the journey. So this, I feel, is the message of there is one who watches over you. As you grow deeper, you become more aware that you are loved and that you are not alone. Now let's try to read from the handbook that accompanies this card so that we can gain more insights regarding there is one who watches over you. The one who watches over you is compassionate and sage. They often come to you in subtle ways, in the wise shape of a tree, in the luster of sunlit clouds, in the song of water running over rocks. To know you have this guardian is to understand that while although there is loneliness, you are never alone. This watcher is linked to the path of your soul, from your first breath to your last, and they will be with you in the great in-between of your lifetimes. The one who watches over you knows the sacred quests of your soul, and when it feels like you have lost your way, they will remind you of your purpose. The psychologist that I earlier mentioned who said something about the quantum moment is Wayne Dyer. Yes, I remember him now. So if you are interested to know more something about this quantum moment, you browse on Wayne Dyer. At the same time also, it would be nice if you can reflect on Psalm 139 and somehow try to see whether, for especially those of you who have experienced already the presence of the Divine, you try to see how the Psalm somehow resonates with your personal experience. Well, that's it for today. Thank you for the likes and comments you've given to the channel. Thank you for subscribing. I hope to see you again soon. Until that time, may God continue to bless your ways.